Today is a very interesting video. Today, the server has arrived. Oh wait, that's right. I haven't even mentioned the server. Oh wait, why? Oh, maybe because I don't upload. Oh, I really should freaking upload. All right, well, here's the first video in a very long time and it is a cool one. You can probably tell what it is just by reading the description, but I'm gonna wait until I pick up Caleb at six o'clock until I show you what we've got. I asked you on Instagram, about this. Now, based on that, you should be able to guess what I'm doing and you should also be able to guess based on the sound you're hearing in that room right now. What's in that room, you ask? Oh wait, yeah, that's right. I also didn't mention that. That's something else that I have been working on off camera. Right here, we have an Avid storage server, quite low powered with a Pentium 4, but it's enough for what I need it for, which is just Plex, Plex files, my personal files, videos that I upload, and a bunch of other stuff that I may need to keep on data storage. But that is not what I want to show you. What I want to show you, as I said, comes later. So, let's go pick up Caleb. First time I'm seeing this alongside Caleb, who is helping me with the camera work right now. And it did come with rails! We could put these on that server cabinet that you saw in the picture below. Yes, that is what that is for. That is for this IBM storage server and storage. the... Not a storage. That's, yes, that is for the IBM X3650 and the Avid storage server. Help me out here. Oh, while also operating camera, while also commentating. I don't have hands. <laughs> it weighs about 25 kilo. Get a hug. I want a hug. A hug. <sighs> Freaking out. Where's the thing? This thing is dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> it is so dangerous. It's a good life. So I'd like it back in one piece, thank you. Isn't that satisfying? Do you want to do something with And close up, close up. Close up, close up. Ooh. Ooh. One more, one more, one more. Are we gonna take this break? Yep. Oh, that is nice. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, so if you're going through TNT, you wouldn't want. There it is. How do I close this? There we go. Yeah. Well, here it is. You're <laughs> sorry, I didn't hit yourself. <laughs> that would have been funny. The storage server, which. I am so glad to own. Like, I, I feel just like a a real OG for having one of these things. It's not as long as I thought it would be. It's actually it's probably be shorter than my other storage server. Let's open it up. I just didn't have it zoomed out the whole way. Should be right. Ooh, baby. One CPU, two CPU. This has two Xeons. Um, I think they're five two seventies, E fives. I don't know. I'll put it on screen. But it's got twenty four gigs of RAM plus the thirty two. I'm going to be adding inside of it, which gives it fifty three, fifty two. 54, 55. P times N, E times F, L times F, I times F, C times L. <laughs> anyway, it's gonna have 56 gigs of memory. It's gonna have two dual Xeons, six core each, 12 logistic, 24 cores in total. What else have we got? Look in the back. We've got two four port gigabit NICs. Nope, sorry, my bad. We've got two two port gigabit NICs. 
a fiber NIC and on board two gigabit NICs and a console port. On the right, on the left, oh, you're right. We've got two, I think, 400 watt power supplies redundant. They don't both work at once, but they work as a fail safe, not in tandem. So this is called Light Path Diagnostics. Looks like a normal panel, right? Ooh, baby. This tells you the status of everything. So CPU will tell you if the CPU is good. Fan will tell you if the fans are good. Temperature, memory, power supply, um, Ethernet link, PCI, even RAID. Everything you need. And it will tell you instantly if something's wrong. Good purchase. We've been waiting for both servers turning on at once. Alright, three, two, wait, I'm in Zen both at the same time. One, go! Are Zen buttons? Yep, there. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy! It's actually not the fan like you're beating it. Okay, I'll put stand up. Check all the switches on the arm um, on the arm um, boards. That isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. That's actually pretty good. 